Our chances? Yeah. How we gonna win? <laughs> hey, we'll try our best, man. These guys, obviously, they, they play probably a whole lot more than we do. Um, but again, law enforcement, we're very competitive. Aaron Watkins is a detective with the Bakersfield Police Department. He and other BPD officers traded their badges and uniforms for a jersey and a basketball Saturday night. BPD on three. Bring it in. We're a team. One, two, three. BPD. <laughs> But the inaugural first responders basketball game against the Bakersfield Magic was not his first time on the court. The first responder of 10 years grew up playing basketball, and he regularly shoots hoops with fellow people in law enforcement. On our lunch break, we'll go over there, go, go uh, work out, go play some basketball, and then go back to work. But again, it's like another way we kind of get together and you know kind of deal with the stress, the stress of being a police officer. And, in today's uh, society. Basketball and sports in general have a way of bringing people together. This gym filled with spectators seeing a different side of law enforcement. Yeah, they're human, you know, just like us. So I don't see them no different, you know what I'm saying? They're, they're here to protect us. Now they're, now they're trying to have fun with us, I'm with it. Those words coming from Bakersfield Magic Center, Marcus Bell. Eyes are on the newest Bakersfield sports team as they gear up for the start of their season in March. But the Bakersfield League Commissioner, Carl Nell Wiley, says that's not the focus of Saturday's game. They're actually the ones on stage tonight. Let's, let's, let's be real. It's fabulous. They need the love, too. They've done so much hard work out there and giving and sacrificing their lives coming home to their families, oh, they're inc incredible. So tonight, tonight's about them. And this is exactly what the league's about. Thank God for Bakersfield Magic. You guys gotta come out and support them now. Come on. In Bakersfield, Kristen Vartan, 23 ABC News, connecting you.